Get Me Out of This Book, Rules and Tools for Being Brave by Kali Dacos and Deborah Collette, illustrated by Sarah Infant. <laughs> I'm Max. I'm a bookmark who used to be scared to death of books. The pictures freaked me out. When I was on a page with the King Cobra, I couldn't look and I shook and I screamed, Get me out of this book! But no one heard and I was trapped. That's when I snapped and went back to school for a special bookmark badge. I had to learn how to handle the scariest pictures in the scariest books. My trainer was tough. He taught me rules and tools for looking right at scary. Then he put me in a book on a page with a shark. It had giant white teeth and it was swimming towards my face. I could almost feel the bites and my heart went ba-boom. Ba-boom, ba-boom. I couldn't look and I shook and I screamed, Get me out of this book! And then I remembered number one of the rules and tools. Breathe deeply. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. I kept breathing and breathing and breathing and breathing until my heart slowed down to ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. And I could look past the teeth to the eyes of the shark and say, you're just a picture and you can't hurt me. Creepy was next. When I was put on a page with hundreds of cockroaches crawling towards me like an army, I couldn't look. And I shook and I screamed, get me out of this book. And then I remembered number two of the rules and tools. Make a plan. I decided to think up a song and sing really loudly. Macaroni, macaroni, one, two, three, you're not real and you can't hurt me. I kept singing and singing and singing and singing until I was able to open my eyes very slowly and look right at those cockroaches. The next book was Haunted. I was put on a page that was darker than dark and I knew spooky dead things were hiding there. I couldn't look and I shook and I screamed, Get me out of this book! And then I remembered number three of the rules and tools. Think good thoughts. I will get through this dark page, I said to myself. If other bookmarks can do it, I can too. I couldn't see anything at all, so I decided to practice. What would I do if a ten-foot skeleton came out of the dark and was ready to attack me? I'd punch him. Then I'd watch his bones fall apart into a pile on the ground. They would look so silly that I'd start laughing and laughing and laughing and laughing. When I stopped practicing, I was all alone in the dark, but I realized that the good thoughts were right there to help me. I graduated from bookmark school and I loved my special bookmark page. I had learned rules and tools and now I wanted to go to the scariest pictures in the scariest books. Before long I found myself in a closet, a dark closet, a locked closet. I was trapped inside with a monster that had seven hairy heads. I wanted to freak out. But I remembered that I had rules and tools and I knew what to do. I started to breathe deeply. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Until I was feeling calm. I made a plan. 
I stood up very tall and pretended I was not afraid. I thought good thoughts. I could do this. I could handle this. I would be all right. I looked right at the 14 eyes in the seven heads. One head was looking up, one head was looking down, one head was looking halfway around. One head was screaming, one head was trembling, one head was closing its eyes, and one head was sobbing big gooey tears. And that's when I realised that the big hairy monster with all those heads was afraid of the dark closet too. I yelled at the heads, Don't be afraid. Tomorrow someone will turn the page in the book and you'll get out and everything will be okay. And then I knew that I would be okay too. Even in the scariest pictures, in the scariest books, because the rules and tools really work. Boo. <laughs>